perfect day for a ball game here at Fayetteville. The seventh-ranked Razorbacks continue their homestand here at Palm Stadium this afternoon with a doubleheader against the Kent State Golden Flashes out of the Mid-America. He is the ace of this Razorback staff, and he gets the ball again today. Troy, he's been outstanding. He sure has. Dixon line for the third straight weekend. Little number to first. Gates with it. No issue there, and Knight collects the first out. And you see Casey Martin over there at third. We highlighted him in the open as a breaking ball is chased after. Skips away from Cook to throw. Picked by Gates at first base. And an exciting strike out there. That one belted to left. Back is Kerstad. He looks up and it's out. A solo home run by Nick Cannabis, his first of the season. And he gives the Golden Flashes an early 1-0 lead. in the sigh relief. 1-2 is popped up on the infield. Biggers drifting into shallow left. He's called off by Kerstad, and the freshman puts it away. But Blaine Knight gives up the solo home run to Nick So far for these Razorbacks. One pop to left. Riley Hawkins has it spotted, battling the Fayetteville Sun, and he holds it. Not really any chinks in that armor so far. Rolls over this one, takes a funny hop off parts and shoots into center. Boy, blistered that ball on the ground. And Martin is aboard, and you alluded to his speed earlier. Swing and a miss. Boy, the high heat by Eli Krause, and he works around the two out. Now Porto puts a jolt to this one. Kerstad on the track, up against the wall. He makes the catch. And we talked about that win today, Troy. 17. Fastball, blew him away. Boy, that was a really good pitch. Breaking ball, bounce to first, Gates charges and makes a play. One, two, three inning for the Arkansas Razorbacks here in the top of the second. 6'3", 190 pounds, that's a pretty, pretty nice improvement. Takes inside for ball four and the leadoff man is on base for Arkansas. That one belted out to left, near the foul pole, it's gone! A two run home run by Grant Cook, his second of the year. And the Hogs in front, two to one here in the second. The ball up in the strike zone. Watch where this pitch is above the belt. He just tomahawks that thing out and just hammered it into the hog pen, in the bullpen out there for the Razorbacks. A lot of people really like this Arkansas team. Backhand attempt by O'Brien skips into center field, and Shaddy is aboard to continue the inning. That way too. There goes a the runner. The throw to second by Del Porto. Not in time, and Shaddy swipes the bag. His first of the year for Arkansas. Inside, moved his back foot. The bags are full. The 2-2 popped him up on the right side. That window play tricks with it. O'Brien has it spotted and makes the catch. So a big pitch by Krause to avoid any further damage. Curveball, wrapped to third. Martin up with it. One away. Grant Cook countered with a two-run shot in the second. Grounder near the middle. Biggers to his left. And he makes the play. Two down. Fastball strike three. Call in the outside corner. And Knight works around the lead. Former big leaguer with the New York Mets as Fletcher pokes this one the opposite way. Slicing into the gap. And it's down for a hit. Hawkins can't play it off a clean hop, and Fletcher glides into second with a double. Chatty now bunts up the first baseline. It's a safety squeeze. Hamilton can't get the tag. They don't call him out on the tag. Coming across to score is Fletcher, and it's a 3-1 lead. But I think Troy and the Hawks will take it. And now they lay down the bunt. Does Biggers, and everybody's safe. And boy, what a great play call there by Dave Van Horn. Right away, catching Kent State napping. And Biggers, who handles the bat. The fastball. 2-2, two, two, this one whacked. Deep out to left. There it goes. It is a three-run blast for Eric Cole. And the Hogs put up a crooked number here in the fourth. It is a 6-1 ball game. Home runs a season ago. This ball's right down the middle, and Eric Cole does not miss it. It's got all that baseball hit that one about 385 feet playing the back at third base and they've already seen several guys go for the bunt. Martin kind of lunges at that one and drops in for a base hit. He's thinking two. The throw by Marinella is late and Martin beats it out for a sliding double. That's what they're going to get 
when they throw Blaine Knight out on the mound. 2-2, two -two, strike three called at the knees. That's number it's, it's amazing the difference. Double play ball to short. They're going to take just one out. So Bryant is forced at first. Chatting on 2-0, oh, whacks it down the line. He thinks he got all of it. He did. It's into the bullpen. A solo shot by Carson Shaddy. His third hit of the day. His third homer of the season. And it's 7-1 Arkansas here in the fifth. Well, the homer at bats have broke out for Arkansas. You just kind of waited. You knew that was going to happen sooner or later. Dave Van Orton. At uh, Arizona State. Hard hit ball to the hole. It's short. Bigger's a backhand play. Long throw, and he got it. The one, two, strike three call in the inside corner, and Knight gets out of the jam. Bob, winners of five of their last six are playing good baseball. As Cook lines this one, center field, sinking quickly. The diving play by Marmorella. He comes up with it and takes away a single from Cook. What a play by Mason Marmorella, and it's a one, two, three inning thrown up. Cole Ramage will make his fourth appearance on the season. You see seven strikeouts in five innings, so he's a power guy. Cut on and miss. Cook has to complete the put out at first and will. Yeah, back back when I played, we didn't have didn't even do interviews. That's another strikeout for Cole Rand. Go right at the hitter. Hard hit ball into right field, and that's only the second time today that Kent State has had the leadoff man aboard. Gotta go back. To Ground ball, Biggers out of its reach, and it's into center for a single. Bomarella drives home the run, and Kent State makes it a 7-2 score. Here's a fly ball into right field into the teeth of the wing, but Cannabis back on it, shy of the track, hauls it in. Jacob Kostyshak, the sophomore out of O'Fallon, Missouri, he'll be on the bump in inning number 9. Temperature is dipped a smidge. As Kostyshak disposes of Del Porto. Kostyshak getting his... Name etched into the line score. Here's a bouncing ball right side. Pass the dive of Shetty. Halting at second base is Parks and Kent State playing for the big inning here in the ninth. Ground ball could be two. Shetty to Biggers to first. Double play and that will be the ball game. A 7-2 final score this afternoon as the Hogs take game one of the series and the opener.